geometry action of triangle when length of all the three sides are given construct triangle xyz in which xy is equal to 4.5 cm yz is equal to 5 cm and zx is equal to 6 cm before starting our construction we will draw a rough figure from which we will get an idea on how to proceed step wise in our construction step 1 from the rough figure it is clear that first we have to draw a line yz of length 5 cm step 2 from y point x is at a distance of 4.5 cm so with y as center draw an arc of radius 4.5 cm step 3 from z point x is at a distance of 6 cm so with z as center draw an arc of radius 6 cm step 4 x has to be on both the arcs drawn so it is the point of intersection of arcs mark the point of intersection of arcs as x join xy and xz triangle xyz is the required triangle as shown in the figure construction of triangle when length of two sides and included angle is given construct a triangle abc in which angle b is equal to 60 degree ab is equal to 4.8 cm and bc is equal to 5.2 cm before doing construction draw a rough sketch so that you will get an idea which side is to be taken as a base step 1 from the rough figure it is clear that we have to draw the base first that is ox is equal to 4.8 cm step 2 with o as center and of any radius draw an arc cutting ox at a with a as center and with same radius draw another arc cutting the previous arc at b step 3 join ob and produce it to get a ray oy angle yox is equal to 60 degree step 4 Take the compass and measure 5.2 cm using a ruler. Taking x as center, cut an arc on the ray OY. Step 5. Join y and x. Triangle YOX is the required triangle. Construction of triangle when measure of two angles and length of included side is given. Construct a triangle APB in which PB is equal to six centimeter, angle P is equal to sixty degree, and angle Q is equal to sixty degree. Just as what we did in the previous construction, here also we will draw a rough sketch of the triangle. Angle P and angle B are the two given angles, and PB is the included side. We will always take the included side as the base. Step one: Draw a line segment PQ is equal to six centimeter using a ruler. Step two: We need to draw angle P as sixty degree. With P as center and of any radius, draw an arc cutting PQ at B. With B as center and with same radius. draw another arc cutting the previous arc at a step 3 join pa and produce it to get a line pr angle rpq is equal to 60 degree step 4 now repeat the same steps with q as center suppose the intersection point of pr and qr is x then 
XPQ is the required triangle. Construction of a triangle when base and base angles of an isosceles triangle are given. Let us construct a triangle having XY and XZ as equal. Base YZ is equal to 6 cm and angle XYZ is equal to angle XZY is equal to 45 degree. Step 1. Use ruler and draw a line segment OB of any convenient length as shown on the screen. Step 2. Now use compass and open it to any convenient radius and with O as center draw an arc which cuts line segment OB at X. Step 3. Again use compass and open to the same radius as of step 2 and with X as center draw an arc which cuts first arc at D. Step 4. Again use compass and open to the same radius as of step 2 and with D as center draw another arc which cuts first arc at C. Step 5. Again use compass and open to the same radius as of step 2 and with C and D as center draw two arcs which cut each other at E. Step 6. Join OE and extend it to A as shown on the screen. Above formed angle AOB is equal to 90 degree. Step 7. Now to construct at 45 degree angle, we will construct the angle bisector of above angle AOB and it's done in the following steps. Again use compass and open it to any convenient radius and with O as center draw an arc which cuts line segment OB at P and OA at Q. Step 8. Again use compass and open it to same radius as of step 7 and with P and Q as center and draw two arcs which cut each other at point F as shown on the screen. Step 9. Join OF and extend to E as shown below on the screen. Step 10. EO is the bisector of angle AOB. Therefore, angle AOE is equal to angle EOB is equal to half of angle AOB is equal to 45 degree each. Now, with B as the center, repeat all the steps and draw an angle of OBA as 45 degree. Join OBH and the triangle OBG is the required isosceles triangle. Construction of an isosceles triangle when equal sides and an angle is given. Step 1. Draw a line segment which will become one side of the angle. Set the compasses on P and set its width to any convenient setting. Draw an arc across PQ and up over above the point P. Without changing the compasses width, move the compasses to the point where the arc crosses PQ and make an arc that crosses the first one. Draw a line P through the intersection of the two arcs. The angle QPR has a measure of 60 degrees. Measure 6 cm with the compass on a scale and cut an arc on PR from Q. It will meet at point M. MPQ is the required isosceles triangle with 6 cm on two sides and 60 degree angle on one side. Construction of a triangle when two sides forming a right angle between them are given. Construct a right angled triangle 
APB with PA is equal to 4 cm and PB is equal to 6 cm and angle BPA is equal to 90 degree. Step 1. Draw the base PA is equal to 4 cm with a scale. 2. At point P, let us draw a right angle APB that is 90 degrees. Place the point of the compass at P and draw an arc with any radius that passes through PA and name it Q. Place the point of the compass at Q and draw an arc of radius PQ at R as shown. Now keeping the compass at R, cut an arc S with the same radius as shown on the screen. From the point R, with the same radius, cut an arc above P. Place the compass at S and cut an arc above P, intersecting the arc cut in step 6. Name this intersecting point as T. Now, join T to P. The angle APT is 90 degree on PT with 6 cm measure and name the point as B. Join B to A. This is the required triangle APB with 4 cm and 6 cm sides and angle P is equal to 90 degree. Construction of a triangle when one side and hypotenuse of a right angled triangle are given. Construct a right triangle PQR in which angle Q is equal to 90 degree, PR is equal to 6 cm and QR is equal to 4 cm. Step 1. Draw QR is equal to 4 cm. Step 2. Name the intersecting point of these two arcs as C. Join AC and BC. Thus, an equilateral triangle ABC is formed.